It was a Red Arrows display above the High Street in Guildford that started the Armed Forces Parade. Led by the band of Her Majesty's Royal Marines, around 950 Armed Forces personnel, veterans and cadets took part. Well, here we are in the historic heart of Guildford, and it couldn't be a better day for this parade. The weather really is beautiful. Now, on my right, we have the Duke of York, the Prime Minister, the Defence Secretary and the Mayor of Guildford and military chiefs all paying their respects to the armed forces. But today is really about the British public, and they've come out in their hundreds up Guildford High Street to show their appreciation for what our troops do. The Navy had a 125-strong marching detachment. The Army was represented by 3rd Battalion, the Princess of Wales Royal Regiment, and the Queen's Colour Squadron took part for the RAF. His Royal Highness, the Duke of York, took the salute as each service marched past, including six instrumental bands. It's just great to see everybody out and everybody supporting our guys, and also to see the younger generation coming through and the cadets, etc. And especially after the events of yesterday, I think it's important that everybody comes out to these events and, doesn't, and shows that terrorism doesn't win and these events can still go on. What did you think about seeing that today? Uh, it was really amazing. And yeah. why was that? Uh, because there were like the marching bands and there was the Duke of York there. And yeah, it was just really good seeing it all. Absolutely fabulous. And, you know, well deserved the support they got. Lovely. Absolutely fantastic. Really proud. Um, I just couldn't stop cheering and just everybody was a star today. It's fantastic. Oh, it's wonderful. One feels proud to be British, I mean really English. And also the moment they brought tears to the eyes was um, the Red Arrows. Absolutely wonderful moment. Um, well, my cousin was holding the flag for the army cadets and also my sister was part of it. So all of us felt really proud. Yes, very, very well. We loved it. Music was good and they all looked so smart, so we had a good time. This is the Seventh Armed Forces Day and it's proving to be a fantastic opportunity for the British public to show just how fiercely supportive they are of the armed forces. Laura Hawkins, Forces News, Guildford.